You're watching Tele Sir English. I'm Katrina Goss. We continue with our live coverage of the high level debate of the 76th session of the United Nations General Assembly. We now go to live to the statements of the representative of Nicaragua. Brother Antonio Guterres, Secretary General of the United Nations, Mr. President, ladies and gentlemen, heads of delegation. We continue to live at a time of a pandemic which is impacting all of humanity, especially developing countries. These are times which test the strength, the faith, and the solidarity of all humanity as we grapple with enormous challenges. We would like to convey solidarity and condol condolences from our comrade, President of Nicaragua, Comandante Daniel Ortega Saavedra, and his companion, the Vice President Rosario Murillo, to the families of the entire world who have suffered the serious consequences of COVID-19 and who have lost loved ones. This worldwide health crisis continues to undermine our efforts to overcome problems and existing challenges such as poverty, hunger, malnutrition, inequality, unemployment, climate change, all produced by the system of capitalist exploitation, which is irrational and oppressive. It is unacceptable that we have hoarding of COVID-19 vaccines by the developed nations, which then prevents distribution, which would be fair and equitable for all, including developing countries. It's inhuman. It's necessary and fair to guarantee the transfer of technology and financial resources and to declare these vaccines as a common good for all humanity. We must continue with our spirit of fighting for humanity to grapple with and overcome the pandemic in solidarity, cooperating without conditions and with robust multilateralism to enable us to have access to vaccines and thereby prevent unequal or politicization of distribution.